Hi, my name is Renato Lima, one of the developers of Plantar, a new R package for managing species records, and also a workflow to deal with this type of data, including data entry, editing, validation, and data summary and export. Here we're going to provide you a small example of how to use the package for a small genera called Cumaniodendro, downloaded directly from GBIF. And this download it can be made in two different um, different ways. Here I'm going to provide you two different examples. You can go to the GBIF online uh, website, filter the information from the genera, click on download, and then use the information from the download link to provide uh, Plantar the information needed to download it directly from the GBIF website. And you can also download the information directly from GBIF and both approaches results in the same number of occurrences. Once the data is uh, inside Plantar, you can, we can edit and Plantar provides different types of edits, including uh, the separation between first and second collectors and the standardization of the format and the division between uh, names abbreviations for both collectors and identifiers. Uh, Plantar also edits information of locality, including country, state, and municipalities, to generate a string of localities which is used to retrieve coordinates from a gazetteer. It also makes sure that all coordinates are in the good format, which is decimal degrees, and it also edits uh, species names and family names, including the removals removal of authors and finding synonyms. After the data is edited, we can validate localities, which means comparing the resolution of the information from the original source with that one we found in the gazetteers. Also the validation of the geographical coordinates, which means cru crossing this information with maps and the retrieval from missing coordinates from the gazetteer. So from 91 original records, now we have 146 records with different levels of confidence. Uh, we also validate the confidence we have in species identifications. So we use the information of who made the identification and cross it with the database of plant taxonomies. And also we assess the information within uh, the type status column to provide uh, confidence levels for the, the identifications. And also, Plantar search and homogenize information within groups of duplicates. So here, three different specimens in three different collections. So we can uh, provide the most up-to-date names of identifiers, years of identifications, and confidence levels we have on those identifications for the group of duplicates. And also, Plantar have tools for summarizing data, including the numbers of records, numbers of collections, uh, number, the main collectors, and species taxonomy, and number of countries. And also, summaries for the flags that were done during the validation process, including duplicate search, locality validation, coordinate validation, and cultivated specimens as well and taxonomic confidence. And finally, Plantar provides a species checklist, including numbers of records, and also vouchers associated to those records. Finally, Plantar has ma many information that users can base the samples to introduce on how to use the, the package, and also a more detailed tutorial where we explain in details each one of those uh, functions. So we hope that this new package can help taxonomies and ecologists and also data managers and curators in the tough job of managing species records from biological collections.